Hello everyone. Hope you're doing well. It's Saturday afternoon. Looking at our new bridge, fairly new bridge. We put this in what? A couple weeks ago. Eh, been a couple of weeks ago, two, three weeks ago. And the dogs are kind of modeling it, I guess. Nope. She's leaving. Ella's leaving. I'm done. But anyway, <laughs> we are going to paint it, right? Just stain it or paint it. This dog is with me. Say hello. Hello. We'll paint it the same as we did the other one, probably. Gonna paint it. Yeah. Okay. All right. But uh, but this bridge is more robust. It will hold humans and it will hold the dog. So and Mr. Dog. Dogs and Mr. Dog and Mrs. Dog. It will hold all of us and other family members and friends that come by. All right. So Teddy's just sunning himself. Yeah. So, okay, first I will go to, I want to give a little garden update. I'll start at the hill where we have berries and such. But I know a lot of you, when we talked about gardening last time, a lot of you uh, were talking about how you were struggling and your gardens were struggling. Uh, mixed results. And so, and, and that's been the case with us. We've had some successes and we've had some real struggles. Uh, but... This is the hill. Mrs. Dog calls it hell hill sometimes because the sun, the sun will hit this thing in about mid-morning. And, and it's an ankle breaker. And it's an ankle breaker. It's more steep than it looks on video or in pictures. But I tell you what, we've got berries, we've got elder, we got elderberries, blueberries, what else? Uh, Blackberries and raspberries and a cherry tree. Cherry tree right there in the middle. The elderberries are the only thing that are not really coming up good. The elderberry? Yeah, okay. we haven't gotten any berries. We have gotten blueberries. We've gotten blueberries and blackberries. Yeah. Uh huh, uh huh. All right. Blueberries and blackberries so far. Here's the garden, the little garden, more part of it. Our sunflowers, some are still hanging on. This dog chopped down a couple of them that were kind of done, I guess you could say. Yes. Okay. Take a closer look. All right. Check it out. They're like freaking 12 feet long. I'm 12 feet tall, I think, at least more I mean I'm 6'2 and these things are towering of course I'm kind of up looking uphill a little bit so you've worked a lot in this bed so this is where we had we have we, we just planted what did you plant cauliflower yeah I pulled out the squash and zucchini except for one squash over there yeah because they were just the heat was just killing them the heat has been killer y'all and I know a lot of y'all are feeling the same the middle of the country is broiling in heat 100 plus degrees i know y'all are feeling it a lot of you are at least uh, well i planted cauliflower but we had got a fall plant we had gotten some squash and zucchini out of it no, not, not, as, not as much as we usually get though yep all right check out the flowers the little flowers so what we got we got we did some more planting here didn't you well, this is that's acorn squash. We got some acorn squash. And that's okra. It's doing really good. We've had a good okra. We've uh, had a good okra crop now. I planted a few more okra there. Planting more. All right. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And this is where I'm going to plant. I'm going to plant beets and carrots for a fall crop here. Beets and carrots. Fall. We had a pretty good carrot little harvest. Yeah. I just, and we had beets harvest, yeah. uh, a beet, uh, some beets as well. Yeah, I just cleaned up that bed today. Sunflower. There, if y'all can see that. Yeah. Yeah, bee in there. Yeah. Ah. Okay. I just cleaned that bed up today, so I'm ready to plant in it again. Yeah. Ella's modeling we, again. Ella's like, hello. She wants to show you the watermelon. Ella is modeling. She wants to show you the watermelon. We got some watermelon going. If you can see this. I'm gonna have to go outside the fence here so we can see it. Let me get her. I'll hold her so she don't run off. Okay. 
We got more watermelon here. That one there. Two more there. Two more there. One there. If you go to your right, you can see one pumpkin. Got one there. We got one pumpkin. Pumpkin coming. over there. We got some pumpkin coming up. One. One. Well, one pumpkin coming. <laughs> we have four pumpkin plants and we have one pumpkin. So we're struggling on the pumpkins. Mm -hmm. All right. Some herbs over there, I believe. This is just another view of everything. Our beans, we, we replanted some beans. The Japanese beetles got them. Japanese beetles absolutely murdered our beans. You can tell the beans that they were really damaged. Check it out. Very disappointing. They ate them. They just ate right through them things. Just ravaged them like nothing. But we plant more. And we're going to adjust our strategy and the beetles should be about gone hopefully by now or soon rather mm -hmm. potatoes are still hoping for um see sweet potatoes these no. are yukon i dug Yukons. up one one and there was nothing in it so i'm gonna let the other two go a little longer and see we had a good crop of new potatoes but we're trying we're trying to get more uh, trying to get the yukon and sweet going. potatoes are over there sweet potatoes are there okay gotcha okay okay that's that. The view of the sunflower. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Miss Dong. And Ella. And Ella. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> All right. I'll be the flowers. Oh, Mrs. Dog chopped these down. Had to use a dang saw. Yeah. Look how thick those things are. So we're trying to decide whether we want to harvest them or the just them. let them have, let the birds have them. We don't know, but they've been pretty. They have been pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Well, that's part of our property. Yep. Hey, Teddy. You can't come out here. But anyway, just a quick tour. A little update. Let us know how yours is doing, what your plans are for fall, winter, and uh, your successes, your challenges. We'd appreciate it. God bless y'all. See you soon.